What's going on everyone? It's Abdallah here, back again with another time trials guide for Mario Kart Tour on Android and iOS mobile devices. We are gonna show you guys everything you need to know about how to beat all three of the time trials in the Paris Tour, getting all the grand stars, showing you all the shortcuts, and giving you guys two different methods of drifting controls. We're gonna show you guys with the manual drift off and smart steering on, and then of course we'll show you with manual drift on, smart steering off. So those are the two wide variances of everything that you need to know. It's gonna be pretty cool. And not only that, is I will rotate and I'll show you guys my hands as I'm doing it so you guys can understand how to replicate it on your own in order to get those awesome grand stars so that you can cash those in for tour gifts. It'll be a fun time. So anyway, thanks so much for watching. If you guys like Mario Kart Tour, make sure you guys are subscribed and turn on notifications so you guys are alerted of when we go live. It's gonna be a fun time. All right, so like I said earlier, we're gonna go with the most basic of controls, which is gonna be right over here. It's gonna be manual drift off, smart steering, on. This is something that a lot of people are used to. It's the most basic controls possible and we're going to show you guys how to do this. So let's take a look. The very first level is right over here in the Peach Cup. It is going to be a Toadette time trial. So click on OK when you are ready. I'm going to rotate this way so you can see what uh, what's going on on my screen over here. Now keep in mind I've got a green screen on board so the, um, the coloration is going to be a little bit off but hey you know what it's going to be the exact same thing. So anyway hold on to and then let go on go and you should be all set. So super easy. Try to stay to the left most part of the map as you can. And if you have smart steering on, it's going to be a little bit easier for you. Because smart steering allows you to walk into those walls pretty easily. So we're going to go over here, do another mini turbo. And then we're going to take this shortcut right here. Not too bad. So very simple, we were able to do that and uh, pretty much go from there. So always stay more towards the left. The game will automatically correct you to get you towards the center because you're on smart steering. But as you guys can see, I use the mushroom towards the finish, finish line over that way. So you're fine. You can do the exact same thing. It's just dragging. All right, so 55 is our goal. We're gonna do this. 51, 52, 53, and we win. So that's it. It's as easy as that. Okay, super simple, right? Very simple. Okay, so we did that in 5360 with smart steering on and manual off. I'm gonna show you guys how to do it uh, without that, just in case you guys are curious to see, should I change up my controls in order to get a better score? I don't know, it's really up to you guys. Whatever you're comfortable with. So we're gonna turn manual drift on and we're going to jump into this and I'm gonna knock it out super easily. This is what I like to do um, with uh, my, this is my preferred set of control, so I'm right at home with this one. So anyway, so hold on to, let go on go, and then you're set over here. So anyway, collecting coins doesn't necessarily do anything for you, especially in this. Okay, so I'm going to drag that for a mini, uh, that's a super mini turbo, it makes you go a little bit quicker. Do the exact same thing over here. You get a little bit more boost whenever you do that. So we're gonna do that. I'm gonna uh, turn that into a super mini turbo just like that. Do another one. Ooh, into the sand, that's okay. We got plenty of time to make. All right, here we go, super mini turbo, done. Okay, another mini. We're gonna go this way, dragging here. I'm gonna use my other finger to release that and then unload that. So we did it a little bit faster, a little bit faster. Not too bad, not too bad at all. 52.35, okay, cool, it's a new record, whatever. You think I care about new records on time trials? Unless you're giving me actual rewards for it, don't even talk to me about it, right? There should be, I'm telling you, if there was a ranked mode for time trial, that would be something very special. Okay, uh, as you guys can see, our next time trial is going to be right over here. I'm gonna turn manual drift off. We're gonna turn smart steering on uh, because again, that is the most basic of controls and a lot of people use that. So we're gonna come over here with baby Ouija time and baby Ouija of course is like wearing a black hat now. So um, yeah, anyway. So let's see what we got. Go for your best time. I'll show you guys my hands here. Hand cam, am I right? Hand cam. All right. Hold on to, let go on go, and we should be all set. All right, whoa, 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 this is uh, automatic, isn't it? Yow, okay. Uh, well, I got one shortcut for you guys. I don't even know what standard is, so let's, uh, let's work. 
So you can get a super mini just by dragging that way super easily. Okay, we're going to turn this way, and I'm going to shroom through this. And by shrooming through that, we should be able to cut a lot of the course just like that. Very simple. So making our way through this area here, really nothing to worry about. The game is pretty much smart steering for us. We can hold this mini turbo just like that. And we should be okay. That was 45 seconds. Wow. Yeah, the game is showing you exactly where you need to go. This is fine. Super easy. We're going to trick off of that. And then we're going to hold the turn all the way through. Just hold it, hold it, hold it. And you should be able to let go right there. Easy, be easy. Let's go. We're going to turn this way. Going right over here. Oh, man, missed it. Uh-oh. Okay, well, let's see. <laughs> Just in case you miss it. Wow, okay. If you miss that cut, let's see what happens with your score. Do you even need to do that cut? Yeah, see, that's what I don't like about smart steering, man. That's why you got to turn it off. Um, but anyway, what did we do? 132? I hope it was like 135. I should have looked at that beforehand, right? Okay, so what did we get? 132? Wow, one oh my gosh. Okay, well, that's a very generous... <laughs> that's very generous of them. Smart steering took me off of the way that I wanted to go, and it's very generous. If the game is telling that you got to get 140, and I just did one shroom cut, and I was a I was able to afford to not get the other one, dang, dude. All right, so now we're going to go into manual controls. Wow, that was uh, interesting. Let's go into manual controls. This is my cup of tea, so I'll show you guys exactly what this is like. Okay, here we go. Go for your best time. Alrighty, alrighty. What do we have here? So this is smart steering off, so that means that I am going to be able to go into the grass if I need to. Uh, I don't think you ever need to, but you're going to be okay. So as you guys can see here, I'm going to go into this, and then we're going to go a little wide in order to get the ultra mini turbo right here. Pretty cool. Alright, we're going to do the exact same cut, which is by using the shroom right there. And then, since we are using the manual, I can easily do a super mini turbo just like that. And over here, I think I could unleash another super mini turbo if I'm keeping this uh, pretty good. Yeah, it's not too bad. Oh, look at that. A little bit of snaking, huh? Woo, a little bit of snake and bacon. <laughs> yeah, Mario Kart DS, man. That's my jam back in the day. All right, so I took this super wide, doesn't matter, but we'll get an ultra mini turbo over here. Start our mini turbo right this way so I can unleash a super, maybe. Okay, maybe not. Going this way, here we go. Very easily. All right, we're going to unleash the super. We're going to go a little wide this way to stretch it out. There we go, beautiful. And I think we do one super at the end. Super is the second level. Yeah, there we go. Cool. 131. Not too bad. Not too bad. Okay. Well, uh, yeah, I mean, it, it was... I'm sure you guys can do better than 131. That's nine seconds under standard, so I like that a lot. Cool. All right. Well, next up is going to be our last tour in the Waluigi Cup. It's going to be the Shy Guy time trial. The Shy Guy time trial is pretty interesting. Uh, let's give the smart steering on, manual drift off. And we should be all set for this one. Okay, I want to take a look at what the standard is. Standard should be shown 155. All right, personal best is 147. Not bad. All right, here we go. Here we go. Hands on, right? Hands on. Know what you're doing with your thumbs. Okay, here we go. This is... Oh, Shy Guy was... Oh, I love this level. Yeah, it's my favorite level. Hold on, too. Let go. There's really only one shortcut to take, and it's going to be right at the end, and I'll show it to you guys really simply. Okay, so come this way, do a mini turbo that way, and then just hug this wall. If you hug the wall, you're going to be fine. You can drag this way and do a mini, probably, maybe not. Okay, that's fine. All right, hug the wall here, do a mini. You're going to hug the wall here. You're going to hug the wall that way. Keep hugging, keep hugging. There we go. Okay, straighten yourself out. You got a lot of boost ramps this way. 
So you can go look, Ma, no hands, and it'll be fine. Rail, rail. All right, so flying through here, just stay straight. Don't need to do anything. This is where you want to start uh, looking at your shroom. Oh, man. Yeah, you know what? That's really hard to do with smart steering on. Are you crazy? All right, I got to try something else. That's really hard to do with smart steering on. Wow. All right, so moral of the story is if you're able to and you're comfortable, I would say try to turn off smart steering so that you have a little bit more control over where you can go. But that's where that shortcut's at. At least the one that I would recommend for the level. Meow. Kind of sound like a cat. Like an alley cat. Meow. All right, I'm going to try this. I'm going to attempt this again with the uh, smart steering on just to see how uh, how we do. Yeah, not so well. What do we have to get? 150? I don't remember what we're supposed to get. Like 155 or something? It's hard to do with smart steering. Yeah, 150. Oh, dude, that's great. We're fine. <laughs> we're absolutely fine. Okay, so I showed you how to do that. Like, we couldn't even get the shortcut with smart steering. So I believe that all of you guys can easily get that one. So now uh, what we're going to do is we're going to go over, turn smart steering off. We're going to go manual drift. And I'll show you what it's supposed to look like, especially with manual drift on. And maybe we can bust out some ultra mini turbos along the way. So anyway, here we go. Let's jump on into it. I'll narrate my moves as we go so you guys can see it. And we'll go. All right, here we go. Doing a little bit of snake in here. I think we could do one mini turbo. There we go. One little baby mini. Getting like maybe a super over here. Yeah, big super. Okay, so I'm going to hold a mini turbo facing towards the left this way. We're gonna let it go and then uh, we can easily hold another one here. So this is cool. I'm gonna hold it all the way through and release there. We're gonna go super tight here. We're gonna go through the jars. Why the heck not? Go this way. You can stretch this all the way through if you really wanted to for an ultra. And we're just gonna straighten ourselves out. So that's pretty cool. Okay, don't really have to do anything over this way. We can just stay straight. And then now we want to start holding towards this direction, boost through with our shroom, and then hit these ramps. While holding this mini turbo. Ooh, boy! Oh, dang, look at that! That ultra mini past the line? I don't think I've ever done that before. That's pretty cool. My first time doing that. Okay, we're just going to be dragging the wall here. That's fine. You can drag the wall. Start holding your drift. Drift in this way, hold the drift continuously, turn here. If you're good enough, you could probably get an ultra mini turbo there. I'm gonna go wide there, cut in tight here. Stretch this for an ultra mini turbo on the straightaway here. And then straighten out. It's easy, man, it's easy peasy. All right, so now We've got this harder part. You just hold, and then we're going to go shrooming through the sand all the way over. I'm going to unleash the mini turbo, and then we win. 145. My goodness. Whew. 10 seconds, uh, 10 seconds under standard. My, my. And that was my best run, too. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right. Again, I don't really care about time trials. They're not giving me rubies. They're not giving me coins for doing it, so whatever. Uh, but no, guys, that's going to be it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys learned all of the different lines and where to use the shortcuts in order to get all of your grand stars so that you guys can absolutely capitalize on all the tour gifts available for you. It's going to be a great time. So if you guys enjoy this, be sure to smash that like button, especially if it helped you out and helped you achieve all of these different scores. If you guys are looking forward to even more time trials, don't worry, I got you covered with the upcoming tours whenever they come out. And uh, if you guys like Mario Kart Tour, make sure you guys are subscribed. We play this game every single morning and uh, we do it live in front of a live YouTube audience especially you guys so uh, that's it thanks so much for watching I'm so glad that you guys enjoy the content and we'll see you guys on the next one take care